CTV News at 5 with Hudson Mack. Good evening. Thank you for being here. Winter got a head start on southern Vancouver Island today. It doesn't officially arrive until Friday, but it sure felt like it this morning. This day started out with snow and cold, and although a white Christmas may not be in the forecast for Greater Victoria, an icy one could be. And already the chill is taking its toll. CTV Stephanie Sherlock reports. It's beginning to look a lot like winter. Many in the Victoria area wake up this morning under a blanket of snow. We had notion that this was coming uh, probably about four days ago. And being prepared is key when it comes to activating the extreme weather protocol. More people are coming in and seeking shelter, so we open up additional shelters in church basements and community centres and such all around Victoria. Including at the Salvation Army Men's Shelter. In addition to the emergency beds, we also offer coffee service um, and snacks. On certain days we have community meals just to keep people out of the elements when it's cold, rainy, snowy. Understanding that a fresh dusting of the white stuff can also cause problems for drivers, the city of Victoria gets to work before it starts to fly. We can take the salt, we can put it into solution, put that in the brine unit and we can pre-wet the roads and by pre-wetting the roads when it does start to snow then the, the snow won't stick, it'll start melting right away. But there's plenty of salt on hand just in case. With crashes and claims higher in winter months, ICBC wants you to help yourself. Now's the time if you don't have winter tires on your vehicle that you want to consider it for sure. Ensuring your vehicle is in top shape for the cold keeps you and other drivers safe. The temperature is crucial. Snow is not the key indicator. It's just as it drops down below 7 degrees Celsius is when you start to develop that loss of traction. And as we all know, the weather in our region can change in mere moments or kilometers. Like with any driving in the CRD area, you can go from a dry road to a wet road to a snow and icy covered road in a short distance. We do encourage everybody to, to take care and, and be responsible. And CTV Stephanie Sherlock joins us now live with more. Stephanie, the snow didn't really last in the city today, but it looks cold out there. You know, when the wind picks up, it certainly is chilly out here. It depends on where you are, what's giving you the shelter, but it's also a good chance for us to remind everyone about driving and pedestrians. You know, slow down a little bit if it's going to be icy. Drivers, pay attention. Pedestrians, make yourself seen. It's very important. It takes a long time for vehicles to stop when the roads are icy. And, you know, this holiday season, it really is better to be safe than sorry. And, of course, bundle up. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Stephanie, thank you. You're welcome.